welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here if you are new here hey what's up my name's Danny and this video is going to be a really fun one I feel like ever since I started my new job which at this point is like two three months ago I have this newfound love for just documenting anything work related that I can of course the most of that happens on Instagram but I like doing longer form content on YouTube and really just showing you guys more of what I do because I think what I do is really cool and you guys seem to agree so far. One really big part of this job is the fact that I travel quite often and honestly it's the most exciting aspect of this job for me because I love traveling and the majority if not all of these trips involve going to cool places and meeting really cool people and being able to work with them and create really cool content. Of course, there are just so many things that go into this job as a whole, and you guys have quite a few questions about why these trips are more last minute and what I'm even doing and like what my job is. So I'm hoping to be able to answer a few more of those questions in this video for you all, but that's gonna be a later thing because I do need to head off to the office. So I'm going to pack up my stuff, look at my messy bed. Actually, don't look at my messy bed. Look how cute this dress is. This is one of my favorite things that I own and I wear it all the time. It's from Princess Polly. But I'm gonna pack up my tote bag and we are going to head off to the office. Let's go! but they all have two things in common. The first of which is that they are all booked very last minute, and two, they are all about 48 hours long. So because of that, I don't really have time to pack a lot, nor do I need to pack a lot. So typically what I will pack in is this duffel bag from Brandy Melville, as well as this backpack that is falling apart from Jansport, and this tends to do the trick. Okay, but let's rewind, and I'll tell you a little bit more of like the basics, especially like my job title. I don't think I've ever actually said that in a video. So I am a social media brand account manager at a digital marketing agency. The agency is actually based in the South, and obviously I was hired knowing that I live in New York, and them hiring me was kind of part of a overarching goal of building out the New York team, which is very exciting for me. I love being part of like the conception and like the initial stages of something. It kind of just makes me feel like I have a little bit more of a purpose, and it's really nice to be able to connect with like the growing team in New York. So that's been really, really nice. And essentially, I work on one very large account. I work on Raising Canes. You guys definitely know this if you follow me on Instagram or anything like that because I'm always posting about the cool shit that we're doing, rightfully so. And yeah, that's like my main focus. That's probably one of the biggest differences between this job and my previous. In my previous role, I worked on a book of business of about nine to 10 clients. And in this job, I just have one very large client and I, honestly i like the structure so much better honestly every day of me working this job for the past three months has looked super different which i think is one of the things that i love most about it i think any job has the potential of becoming a little bit mundane but this one i think steers very far in the opposite direction of mundane because it definitely keeps me on my toes <laughs> like the longest travel day known to man i finally made it to alhambra california which i could not tell you where this is or like what goes on here but it's near pasadena and that's literally the extent of what i know but the hotel is really really nice this was delaney's pick and i will give her full credit for this because it's really really nice i love i'm pretty sure this is a king size bed regardless i love it and i need it right now bathroom Stunning. 
I've already made myself at home very clearly and normally the first thing that I do the second I get to a hotel on a business trip is jump in the shower. But right now I am so beyond hungry that I already placed an order for McDonald's that is being delivered in the hotel lobby as we speak. So let's go get it. Last night was one big holiday Cool winds on me out by the shade I just feel like there's no rules when you're in a hotel. Like eating in bed, totally fine. Ordering McDonald's, acceptable. Actually, encouraged. I actually probably shouldn't have a soda considering it's like past me. This right here is what dreams are made of. I honestly could not be happier right now. I have my McDonald's order, chicken McNugget meal, and then I'm watching Gilmore Girls, and it's just such a good night. Like, <laughs> what is my life right now? I don't understand. I just got off the coolest meeting that unfortunately, for you guys, I cannot say anything about. Even though this is going up afterwards, I still just can't. But these are the reasons why you need to follow me on Instagram because everything is a little bit more real time there. But I just like cannot believe the life that I'm living right now with this job. It's so crazy. <laughs> 11.20 right now, which means I don't have to leave for an hour, but I figure I might as well be ready early because I don't want to be the last one ready and I certainly don't want to be running around. So the getting ready process for these shoots is always pretty simple. I always wear the same outfit because we have to wear a Raising Cane shirt as well as jeans with no rips in them and sneakers so we're comfortable when we're running around. And when it comes to like my makeup, realistically, I don't have to get fully ready because it's not like I'm the talent and I'm the one on camera the entire time, but I always do like to put my best foot forward because we are with clients. So that's one reason why I like to do a full face. And also there is always the sneaky possibility of being caught on camera. So I'd rather not look, you know, heinous. The good thing is this hotel that Delaney chose for us to stay at is super close to the Raising Cane's location. So we don't even really have to leave that early, but I think we are gonna go a tiny bit early so we can shoot some TikTok content and some Instagram content, more so for like the future that we can slot into calendars, less so for right now. I'm also gonna be wearing a hat. So like, do I really need to do anything with my hair? No, but am I going to? Probably. The biggest compliment and also the biggest bonding point that I've had with my clients up until this point is them texting me out of nowhere after we had one of these shoots asking me to lay out every single makeup product that I use because they love the way that my makeup base looks. I am, I mean, very proud of how far my makeup has come because I feel like I've been trying a lot of new products recently and they've really been doing it. So the fact that they noticed and then asked for a full comprehensive list was like everything and more to me. And we're ready. Got the cane shirt on, my jeans with no rips. I'm just gonna pop on my sneakers. And then I also like to bring a crossbody purse, like a fanny pack or something like that, because there is stuff that I have to carry. And then I also, actually, do we even need that? Because I am bringing my backpack so I can also bring my laptop. We'll figure it out. So this drive through shoot that we're doing is with a comedian named Drewski. Honestly, I'd never really watched too much of his stuff before, but I was doing a whole bunch of research for the shoot and he's really funny. And this one's actually going to be kind of interesting because he's doing the drive through in character. So he's not really going to be like himself. He's going to be this different character, which is super cool. So I am pretty much ready. I'm gonna put on my sneakers and I'm meeting Delaney in the lobby in about, what time is it? Oh my God, I'm looking for my phone and you're literally right here. Um, I think I'm meeting her in like five minutes. So let's get going. Hi. Hi. Danielle informed me she was vlogging and she had Exactly. And now after like three months of working this job, Delaney has still not been in the vlog. So here we are. It's, it was about time. Exactly, it's been time. And the event starts in hopefully soon. Ho hopefully five, probably fifteen. <laughs> we'll see. Delaney, 
Show us the goods. <laughs> Woohoo! Between this and the drinks that are on the way. Very nice. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, the vlog. Uh -huh. This is quite the setup we have going on here. a.m. and we're headed back home. That was the fastest trip to Los Angeles you will ever see. Let's go back to New York. It was so early.